This is a video on the icosadodecahedron. In this Archimedean solid series, I'm showing how the five platonic solids can be used to derive the 13 Archimedean solids. Across the top here, we have the five platonic solids, and we're going to be using a process called rectification. Two of the Archimedean solids can be found by rectification. The dodecahedron and the icosahedron can be used to make the icosadodecahedron. Here is another view of the icosadodecahedron. It is really a fantastic shape. In the Archimedean solids, each face must be a regular polygon. This one is made up of pentagons and triangles. Not only does every vertex have the same degree, which is 4, but every edge is also identical. Every edge has a triangle meeting a pentagon, which gives it extra uh, symmetry. In order to show how the icosadodecahedron is found, we're going to use the Truncate Expand and Snubify website. What we're going to be using is the Truncate applet. So let's come down here. I think I'm going to start with the icosahedron. Here's the icosahedron, and it is made up of 20 triangles. You may remember in the truncation video that we can truncate to get the truncated icosahedron. If we continue this process all the way to the midpoint, we get the icosadodecahedron. Let me show that again. Here's the original icosahedron, and I truncate all the way to the midpoint of the edges. This can also be found by rectifying the dodecahedron. The dodecahedron is made up of 12 pentagons. If we truncate all the way to the midpoint, we get this lovely figure that is made up of pentagons and triangles. Now I have some questions for you. On the left is the icosahedron and the information associated with the icosahedron. On the right is the rectified icosahedron, the ico icosadodecahedron. Pause the video now and answer these questions. As an optional set of questions, you can answer the same questions using the dodecahedron. The final answers for the number of faces, edges, and vertices should be the same as on the previous slide. So if you wish, pause the video and answer these questions. Have a great day.